Hi, Emmy. <laughs> so, Emmy's showing off one of Laura Jane's awesome sculptures. And we're in Logan, Utah at uh, the annual winter gift market. And this is the first time Laura Jean has ever had her work shown publicly and she worked yeah. so hard on it. And uh, it's the first time I've ever had a body of work. Well, like, this yeah, like a collection. you've done pieces, yeah, but I've done one at a time, like eight years ago. Yeah, and it's been a long time. And in fact, um, so this one is I guess probably the most similar to things that she did in the past and of course this is this one's new and so we did a lot of Halloween stuff which is so fun and so cute I love it and um, and some houses made out of blocks of recycled wood old stuff that we had around and that one was a mistake we filled it in with paper clay but uh, forgot to paint it that's my fault <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, I just love them. So much personality. So we figured with the uh, combination of Halloween and Christmas, it's kind of like Harry Potter-ish a little bit. And these are a couple that Everett did. Uh, that and can't find the other one. Oh, this yeah. Our old cute house. little owl. Yeah, it's a little model of our old house. Our cute tiny house. It was awesome. Um, unfinished one there. These are all made out of paper mache and homemade paper clay and some store-bought paper clay. But look at the detail on these. I have no problem gushing about the awesome work of my wife. And her shop is called Little Lola's. I, sh I say shop because she's on Etsy, but um, most of these aren't on there yet. because they're. We were working busily for many days, actually several months, getting ready for this show. There's nothing like a nothing like a, a live show to uh, get someone motivated to create a lot of work. This was fun. This is uh, thanks of getting some comments. Some people are saying nice things. Thank you guys. Um, this was fun. I was I was helping Lord Jean with this, um, trying to make a smile, smiley face, and I was holding Emmy at the time, <laughs> and she bumped me, and it made this funny little frowny face, and so we just went with it. I think it's awesome. <laughs> Look at these sandas. They're all so different. It's so unique. A tangled up snowman guy. These are about, well, there's my hand. You can see how, how tall they are. How much are we, how much are you charging for those guys? I'm thinking maybe a hundred. dollars for those ones. Works of art. Look at this. <laughs> I honestly, you cannot look at these, at any of these without smiling. They're just such unique faces. Can't see them all, but these are supposed to be snowmen and they kind of evolved from snowmen into more like, they kind of look like 1920s vintage cartoons or something or advertisements. And, but they're still snowmen, the carrot noses. Almost like old vintage Disney a little bit. That wasn't intentional, but it just kind of turned out that way. Obviously a vintage or old-fashioned flair to all of them. Look, and we even accidentally decorated the tablecloth with, <laughs> with snow. Oh, this guy is the, what do you call it? The, the, the ultimate, ultimate, ultimate guy, ultimate the creme de la creme. I was gonna almost say coup d'etat, but that's not right, <laughs> the right French term. <laughs> So cool. Really, I could see this being in an art gallery and selling for $1,000. Such a work of art, amazing. Standing on a pedestal in the world. So, <laughs> and then she also invented these girls. Again, such unique personalities, it just, I just love them. I think she could really just go anywhere she wants with this, and it's just so exciting. She's had so much fun. I think Lord Jean was telling me that she thinks these are were her favorites to produce, 
although she definitely had fun with the Santas. They just took so long that, you know, by the end of, you know, after 30 or so hours goes into one of these things, um, it uh, can get, can become a tiny bit tedious, you know, whereas those other ones were, um, were pretty quick. And again, there's Everett's, and Everett's so excited that he might make some money selling those too. <laughs> he made those a while ago, but so impressive. And then I've got some of mine on, on display here too. Um, whoops, and I almost destroyed them all. <laughs> some mine don't have prices, they're just kind of just sharing with the community. Um, just got a comment that she should make a graphic novel in the style of those girls. That's a good idea. Cool. Thanks, Glenn, for that suggestion. I think she'd like that. Here's Emmy. Hi, Emmy. Hi. You're eating Whoppers. She's been having, she's been surviving on candy and, uh, <laughs> and hot cocoa pretty much all day. We force fed her some healthy food. <laughs> Cute girl. And so we're in this beautiful, this is the annex to a, a, an opera house here in town. Um, really, really kind of cool venue. Hey brother, hi. We're meeting all kinds of fun friends. <laughs> to the whole world, this is YouTube. Hi YouTube, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> I have a that doesn't normally use my ink. But, uh, <laughs> I pair it with the antlers. And we have been very privileged to hear her amazing singing voice Thank these you. two days. Oh, beautiful voice. <laughs> Instagram is so a for anyone who knows, wants to know, right there we there. go. Okay. I have no problem with plugging others. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of cool stuff here. I love things like this where we get to hang out with with friends. Well, I should say new and old friends. We, a few of the people we've known before, so we kind of see them around. So whenever an art event happens, you tend to see a lot of the same people. <laughs> and it sort of um, becomes this little family of, of hello, there's me. Hey guys. Um, becomes like a family of, of artist friends and we've been giving things to each other and trading and it's just a lot of fun. Look at this fun place where we're at. An art gallery downstairs. And this world-class opera just to the side. Um, can't show you that right now because it's not open. And you. Making a quick video. Chris, hi. This is our friend Chris Yancey doing custom work right now for people while showing his other really cool stuff. Um, if you think this is cool, check this out. This is his bronze sculpture. Isn't that gorgeous? It amazes me that that can come from somebody's fingers and mind. Just gorgeous. Fantastic artist there. I'll plug Chris. Chris actually, <laughs> if anybody ever wants to go to his site, there it is. <laughs> Emmy's acting as host almost. She's going everywhere. <laughs> Can't find the other kids. They're just wandering around, kind of making this their, their home for the, for the day, for a couple days. All right, well, um, I guess that's it. I wanted to show everybody. Um, if you um, are interested in enlarging sculptures, um, you can go to, well, yeah, go, go to her. Uh, excuse me, let's see here. How do I turn this around? Oh, hi, Dad. Yay. My dad is visiting my brother. I wish I was there. That would be fun. There's Laura Jean's Etsy shop. Etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash little Lola's. That's the, that's kind of a play on um, her uh, nickname. 
when she was little. They would call her Lola Kajin. Actually, they still do sometimes. <laughs> anyway, I, if you can't tell, I'm thoroughly proud of and impressed with what my wife has done. And amazingly, she's been able to do this and uh, take care of and educate our kids at the same time. Incredible. <laughs> it's all right. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a good rest of your day. Hi, Dad. <laughs> We love you too. Thanks guys for watching. And we will um, make an attempt at making uh, regular videos again. Um, again, different format than before. Um, but uh, this will work better for our, our lifestyle, uh, our busy lifestyle where we focus on our art and our family instead of homesteading because uh, it's not so much what we do. And uh, anyway, um, we will... Uh, Talk to you later. I don't know how to stop this thing. I guess I'll just close it or something. I don't know. You may just watch me for 10 hours trying to close it. So bye, maybe? Yeah, all right. Okay, figured it out. See ya.